Assalamu alaikum dear students this is me your coding instructor and in this video tutorial we'll be discussing one of your topics of term 1 examination that is patterns but before moving ahead let me tell you a short and a very interesting story once what happens aisha and her sister were walking home on their way they saw many different things like after reaching home they decided to play with their dart game and you know the dartboard had many beautiful and different colors just have a look After some time in their bedroom they noticed curtains on the window the curtain had many different and beautiful designs you can see here and later on they saw iron grills in the balcony so my dear scholars every day we see many such patterns around us so my dear scholars in simple terms let me make you understand if any number if any figure if any shape or if any letter gets repeated again and again over and over in a definite sequence then we call it as a pattern so dear students for better understanding let me show you some more examples practically here so that you can understand the concept of pattern in a very proper way dear students we can have patterns with any figures numbers letters codes and words in the first example a circle comes first then a triangle a circle and a triangle again a circle and a triangle and this sequence forms a pattern in the next example we have numbers 1 1 2 2 3 3 4 4 5 5 and 5 even this sequence forms a pattern and this is known as number pattern In the third example we have letter pattern and the pattern is a a b that means two times a one time b in the next we have b first and b has been written two times then c again c comes first and it has been written two times then d then d comes first it has been written two times then e even this sequence forms a letter pattern in the fourth example we have code sequence let me tell you what is a code code is the combination of letters as well as numbers fine in this example let us see code pattern a b 1 for example if we will ignore these numbers how can we read them a b c d e f g n h now we will come to numbers 1 2 3 and 4 and this sequence forms a code pattern in the last example we have some words given but in each word there is something same and what is same let us check the first word is right 
the next word is bright the third word is sight and the fourth one is height let us check what is same in these given words r i g h t bright b r i g h t bright s i g h t sight h e i g h t height and all the words ends with a pattern and this pattern is known as spelling pattern in each word you can see that at the end of the word there is the pattern i g h t i g h t i g h t i g h t and this pattern is known as spelling pattern i hope with the help of these examples you have understood all about patterns thank you